ask you how the crash in crypto has affected just general demand for your services when it comes to blockchain consulting, because there was all this excitement, right? At the end of last year, beginning of this year, and there's, I would think, have been an effect from what we've seen from the prices. Yeah, absolutely. It's really interesting. So we sort of divide the world into what is distributed ledger technology and enterprise application of blockchain technology, and then what is happening in the cryptocurrency sure. markets. And so they are a little bit distinct. Um, of course, we saw a run-up in excitement around crypto um, at the end of last year with the listing of the futures and so on and so forth. Um, We're still seeing tremendous excitement, both from issuers of potential token assets that could appear on these networks. Um, We're still seeing a lot of demand, people trying to figure out, okay, what is the uh, method through which I could bring digital assets to the market? How would I list them? Where would I list them? What is the appropriate market infrastructure for me to connect to? So we're still seeing that despite the crash. Um, And we're seeing that actually this phenomena of you know what is the interest in digital assets and the token economy more broadly is quite distinct from what is the price of Bitcoin right now because some of these assets are not cryptocurrencies of course right they're access rights to networks or security tokens and so on um, and so that's still you know really an exciting area for us the demand though for blockchain advisory services to your question um, is still really 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 strong and to the extent that it started in financial services because the idea was that you know again we could take cost out there was a potential disruption effect on that sector um, it's actually Actually, every sector that we deal with that's interested in this hmm. technology. 84% of respondents to your surveys. So there is one of the greatest clips I'm happy to share with you guys because it's really important to understand this that basically there is a lot of disruption potential and it's just not in the banking financial uh, service industry but it's in a lot of different sectors and like I said the reason why we had this crash is because a lot of this technology it's going to take several years to develop and implement. So if you are going to be investing in crypto, it's definitely not a get-rich-quick scheme. It's a long buy, hold, and for the most part, I highly recommend to educate yourself and to understand you know, what each coin and what each technology has to offer um, because obviously if you better understand what you're investing in, it will help you kind of learn from your mistakes at least and also... Uh, with your knowledge that you gain over time as you educate yourself, you'll be able to make better investments in the crypto space as more and more capital floods into this market to take advantage of the ability um, to disrupt this market. But uh, let me know your thoughts on this and I will talk to you soon.